I am a blind wheelchair user. I never assume I can get into an art gallery or exhibition. I never assume I can access the contents of an art gallery. I never assume artists will think about how their art will be experienced by me. I never assume art will work for me. I never assume I can get to an art workshop. I research everywhere I want to go. I research everything I want to engage with. This is my normal, but it's not normal. It's abnormal. It's exclusive, alienating and frustrating. Art should be accessible to everyone, to experience, enjoy and critique, to learn, practice and create. Does art work? Only for some. Invisible is a 3D printed mandala mounted on a circular 30 centimetre canvas, all painted in black. The mandala represents the barriers to access found everywhere disabled people try to go. You can touch this piece. Yes, really, I invite you to touch this piece. Close your eyes and feel with your fingers. What do you notice? What shapes can you feel? Can you picture it in your mind? Can you draw what you feel? Does that make the invisible visible? There is another part to this piece of art. Can you find it? Invisible Visible is a digital painting. It is the visual version of the tactile piece. The mandala design is painted over an abstract representation of Henley, again in a 30 centimetre circle. You are looking down on a light blue body of water, darker blue at the edges, which meanders and across an abstract circle of browns, greens, reds and creams. The calm of the River Thames is in sharp contrast to the busy townscape of Henley. Floating above is an octagonal mandala in brick red with highlights in cream and shadows in brown. Perhaps this is a compass pointing in eight directions. Perhaps it is a building with hard edges and sharp roof lines. Perhaps it is a set of steps blocking access. Perhaps it is a blueprint for accessible design. I wonder. Invisible visible, I wonder. Did you see Invisible Visible as you entered the gallery in Henley? Did you notice that Invisible Visible wasn't visible inside the gallery? Did you spot Invisible? Did you touch Invisible? How did it feel to touch Invisible as a piece of art in a gallery? Could you picture Invisible in your mind when you touched it. And finally, did you realise that invisible and invisible visible are the same?